Hello people and welcome to my Egg Scepter build where you can literally freeze the world. So the weapon of choice is the Egg Scepter. This will be able to just freeze rooms quite easily with a combination of the grenades too. You're literally knocking down a room. Aspects and fragments. The first one is cold stop grenades. Paired this with the exotic Omni Ancy gloves. Essentially you'll have two grenades to throw around and freeze the room. Pretty good. The next aspect will be ice flare bolts. This with a combination of the gloves allows for your shattered targets to flare out a seeker that will then essentially lock a room down combined with the scepter. It truly is a good way of just locking something down efficiently. The next one will be glacial harvest. Whenever you freeze a target, it will generate a stasis shard. This is on like a five second cooldown. Combine this with elemental shards and this is your primary way of getting charged with light. Whisper of Fishes, so whenever you freeze a target and you blow them up, their explosion will be bigger and they do more damage. The Sasis Shards that you're generating everywhere will also give you an overshield, which is good. Helps with survivability. The Shards that you're generating will also come to you, similar to Seeking Wells. The final fragment is Whisper of Chains. As you're freezing things, you'll be surrounded by frozen targets, which gives you uh, resistance which helps with the survivability of you. As the gear we've got elemental shards and elemental charge so those elemental shards that you're picking up will also charge you with light. We've got a grenade kickstarter just to really help with a grenade and a couple of trace rifle ammo mods to really help stock up the ammo efficiency of the gun. And finally we've got font of might with high energy fire and a time dilation in there to still increase the duration of those two buffs along with bomber and then some more trace rifle ammo efficiency mods to help and the other one is the thermal strike uh, mod which allows for double resistance from the artifact mod along with some restoration mods for the orbs of power which will increase your energy regain from orbs of power so for me this is quite a fun build if you're bored of the turret spam if you're interested in a turret spam please look at the top of the screen now and there'll be a link to a turret spam video i did a few days ago which will show you the strength of just having turrets everywhere granted the build is not as strong as last season due to some of the artifact mods missing but it's still fun to play you can rinse through content pretty quickly you can control the area just by shooting one thing and if you really want to conserve ammo you can essentially freeze the target and then pull your gun out and finish them off and if you've got a gun with something like demo on it you're laughing because that will just be an easy kill and then here you can see that the Aegis Scepter just melted that boss because of its uh, other perk where if you hold down R when you've got your super up it will also just face melt everything as you can see that my super slowly going down but the combination of this font of might and high energy fire it just hits hard and with the shards always coming at you you're always charged with light you always pretty much got the font of might buff on and um, with the time dilation it keeps it up all the time yeah thank you for getting this far so if you've enjoyed the build video please like comment and subscribe as it goes far with the youtube algorithm gods and yeah thank you for watching and hope to catch you on the flip peace